what's up everybody how y'all doing man we are back and on the bike it's been a minute i honestly haven't ridden the bike in about a week and a half uh maybe a week or so about a week either way doesn't matter it's been a minute so yeah we're back we're riding last time i rode the camera fell off so that's a little unfortunate but we've moved it it's in a different spot hopefully it works a little better this helmet grips my face so tight that I have a lisp when I talk. I hate it so much, but what are you going to do? Either way, I may have not seen the placement in terms of video, what it looks like. So here we are, we're making a video. We also had audio issues. So the video of where it fell off and all of that, it just deleted it. It is not useful and uh, whatever. We're down we're down about two videos so the last video will have been the review for the bag and everything which is uh, a little unfortunate but it is what it is man we'll see how this view turns out and we'll see if we have better luck with the microphone in the position in which it's in now but it feels good to be out and ride it's been raining and just like generally shitty here so I've not been out and about oh god got a weird flap going on with my hood but uh <clears throat> yeah essentially it's just been raining and shitty and I've been busy in the house doing work on the house and doing uh actual work so Finally got most of that caught up and got myself in a good spot to where we could come out and ride. It was finally nice enough to come ride too. Honestly, when it's like super cold and I've worked all day, maybe I'm just like not a true rider at heart. But I'm just like, I've spent so many hours outside in the cold riding my bike, like my BMX bike in the past, that I just don't enjoy being out on the bike when it's freezing. I don't know. <laughs> It just reminds me of like the hours I spent pedaling everywhere because I didn't have a fucking car. I couldn't afford it type of shit. And didn't have my license and was always in trouble so I couldn't drive. You know, just the struggle. Just the general struggle. And uh, I just hate. I just hate it. Damn, bro. God trunk or treat going on tonight I thought it was a uh, Friday uh -oh. I hope we hopefully we weren't supposed to go tonight we thought it was Friday oh we still might be able to make it oh I'm fucking sending it bud thank god they were back a little bit cops out, it's trunk or treat dude, you know, there's gonna be kids and families out and about, obviously not walking down the sidewalk over here it looks like, but, you know, they're driving around, we gotta respect the public, god forbid, even though when I'm driving around I see a dude ripping it on their bike, I'm like, hell yeah, brother, you know, brother, brother, <laughs> fuck yeah, brother, I like that tree, it's a nice tree. I love this time of year, it's so nice, everything just goes away, I, like, I don't know, I get that, I get that seasonal depression though, cause I'm like, I can't be outside anymore, meh, uh, I really like being outside man, I really like it, I like it a lot, I like riding my bicycle and my motorcycle, I wonder what the term for, oh god, oh god, we're not paying no attention, we're swerving like a motherfucker. I wonder what the term for motorbike is in Spanish, you know? I never uh, got that far. Because I'm stupid, I can't even, I can't even speak English, so why do I need to learn Spanish? Did that shit for like three years in high school. 
probably another three or four years before that when I was in middle school and intermediate school and shit. I should probably know a little bit more than I do. Ignorant. Ignorant American. It is okay. At least I'm aware. I'm also trying to get better every day that I can. So. Let's not go through that. A little bit of oil and water. Probably water from AC. It's right in the spot for it. Hey, what's up, brother? Little counterbalance. I think that's the one thing that sucks, though, about intermittent riding. Like every time you ride it feels fresh, it's new. I guess it sucks, but it doesn't suck. Because the bike feels a little quick again. But then after like three or four days of just straight riding, you just you feel invincible again. I don't know, it's weird. The same thing with like the BMX and the scootering. I went to the skate park the other day and I was like, damn, I can't do shit that I could do a literal month ago. My body's just not in the same shape for it. Like, yeah, I work out every day now, but it's not. It doesn't condition the same way that riding the bike and the scooter do. Especially the scooter. I feel like the scooter is a little bit more physically tasking than the bike. Just because you have to constantly be pushing and lifting the scooter. And... I get more of like a core and cardio workout with the scooter than I do on the bike. The bike I like just pedal around. My legs are meant for it at this point. <laughs> like, ah oh man, good times. I remember I used to, every day, every day was like 15, 20 miles when I was younger. It's like five miles to the skate park and then riding in the skate park, riding around town at the skate park, right? And then going back to the skate park and then riding home. Jesus. Good times. I wish my legs were as big as they used to be. But it is what it is. I'm slowly getting back to that point. One thing I, uh, I was watching a video and I realized this. Uh, I'm not doing, I'm not looking forward. I'm like, I'm not looking far enough ahead when I'm turning. So I think that's part of the reason that my turns end up shitty. I'm not looking far enough ahead. I'm looking like directly in front of me normally. Not normally, I shouldn't say normally because I'm not always doing that. Like right now I'm looking pretty far ahead. I'm like looking towards the roundabout, at the roundabout. I can see people crossing type of deal. But I don't know how to explain it. I think people will understand though. Like I'm just not looking far enough ahead in my turns. Like, obviously, I need to pay attention to the traffic coming through here. There's a lot of bikes out today. It's a good day to ride. But, like, now I want to look at the end of the traffic circle. Because it's like, I'll ride better. Yeah, see? If I'm looking at it instead of down. I feel like, often I catch myself looking at my hands and then, like, the front wheel placement. And it's like, that is just going to set you up for failure, bro. So... Self-awareness, we've learned something. That's what I, I gotta focus on. And then the bar turn. I do want to turn my bars upside down. I went outside to do it, and then I realized all of these holes for these lines and shit are there. And I'm like, well, how do I utilize them if I flip it? And da 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 da. So I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do to counteract that whole situation. Don't hit me, 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 don't hit me. Seeing that, like I wasn't even looking, I was just driving. Oh shit. A little bumpy there, brother. <laughs> oh goddamn. But yeah, hopefully the audio worked out. Hopefully the video is in a good spot. And it felt good to ride again. Trying to keep the content up, like I said, hopefully through November. I need to get out and make some more videos. 
So hopefully I can figure out what I'm going to do with the, uh, the handlebar situation and uh, maybe I'll just turn them. Say fuck it, turn them and see how I like it. Oh god, those uh, cracks in the road. My, my signal's not turning on, so fuck it. That was a horrible turn. Stay to the right because there's a big old bump right there. Uh, I've lost track. My ADD is caught caught on there. I kind of forgot um, what the plan. Now, the video is through November. I need to get out and ride more. I'm gonna flip the bars and just see how I like it. And uh, yeah, that's probably that's probably it at this point. We'll probably do a video where we flip the bars and uh, just kind of like go through that process, and then we'll have a video riding with the bars and then hopefully a few more riding videos after that um so yeah i will uh see y'all in the next video peace